Hey, I'm back with the tutorial for this monochromatic neutral pink look. So if you are interested in achieving this look, please stay tuned. I'm starting with my eyebrows filled in and my eyes primed. And I'm going in with a transition color. This whole look was created using a Tarte palette. I'm going to have the name of the Tarte palette at the bottom along with the colors that I used. But I used a soft transition color and now I'm going into the inner and outer corner with a kind of slightly pinkish brown color just to give my eye a little bit of depth. You know how I feel about putting it in the inner and outer corner. It just makes a nice shadowed effect. Now I'm just going in and kind of blending that shadow into the brow bone. For the lid, I used a pigment from MAC actually. It's called Whisper Pink. Again, everything will be listed in the bottom box below, so don't worry about it if you miss it here. To finish off this eye look, I'm going to line my eye with a little bit of dark eyeshadow to give me a soft kind of lined look. I don't want it to be too harsh. So I finished off the eye just by adding some eyelashes. Now I'm going in and highlighting and contouring my face. I've been loving MAC's Prep and Prime highlighters and their newer shades for highlighting and contouring because it seems to give me a more natural, sheer kind of highlight and contour look. So now I'm just using my MAC Pro Beauty Blender to blend out that highlight and going in with some Ben Nye powder to set but not bake the concealer. Or not concealer, the highlight pen. I'm just setting it, not baking it. After I set everything, I'm using a MAC Mineral Skin Finish in Dark Tan to contour my face. I decided to go with Dark Tan because it's not too much darker than my skin tone and I wanted to keep this look relatively neutral. So it's just giving me a nice soft contour that still looks pretty natural. And then of course I went in and snatched my nose using the same product. I added a little bit of extra powder to my nostrils just to make them stand off a little bit more and give my nose a little more shape. For my blush, I used my favorite blush. This one is Wealth, Worldly Wealth. <laughs> I'll have the name listed below, but it's a nice shimmery kind of bronzy blush. And to top off my blush, I used a highlighter and Perfectly Lit. Now for my lips, I decided to use a glossy pink lipstick called Give In, and I lined it with Plum Lip Liner by MAC. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Nice kind of neutral lip. And that's pretty much the completed look. This is a really quick look to achieve, and it's very appropriate for just about any occasion. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'm definitely getting back into the routine of posting every week, so continue to look out for me, and I'll see you all in the next video.